Type up the website here. What's going on, everyone? How you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome to Cooking with Greens. We're going to do another super simple one. We have some um, some farm-raised organic salmon that we got on our local market. Yeah, they still have some salmon available at the Harris Teeter. Uh, and I'm going to do a honey, garlic, lemon type um, salmon. And we're going to do also lemon, pepper, asparagus. Super simple. Super easy. Even a boy can do it. Let's get it going with this theme song so we can start going. How's everybody doing? I'll see you, Steph. Simple ingredients, just a few. What is up, how y'all there ran? Face it, I'm fixing to make honey garlic chicken wings. So what you saying? Look, look, Sean said he's on day nine of quarantine. Sean says, I don't go to work. I don't even remember how many days I'm on quarantine. I just had to ask somebody what the day of the week is. You know, that is bad when you start doing that kind of stuff and you're losing the day of the week. It, when you don't go to school and you don't go to work, it kind of feels weird. Like, when we haven't had any events for a while. So, I'm just like, man, what is today real? Is Am I alive? Like, everything gets all <laughs> mashed up together. So... This is my this is my thought on this um super simple thing. We have some salmon. I'm only gonna use half of this because I just realized that my niece is here and she can't have salmon. My mom says she don't feel like eating. So me and Anita are gonna have about half of that. I'm gonna prepare. I'll put the rest up in the freezer so we can freeze that for later. Um I'm gonna go ahead and get some uh, juice from this lemon. And you probably could use apple cider vinegar too. That probably would work. I'm gonna use this juice from this lemon. Uh, some honey, a couple of tablespoons of honey. Um, I want to get some garlic minced up in here. This is just a little bit of broth because I figured I'm going to need a little water. And instead of adding water, I was like, oh, let me just pour a little broth in here. Just going to need a little splashy splash. That's going to add flavor. So that's going to be our sauce. I'm going to try to get this uh, cooked on top of the stove. I'm going to add that sauce here. And once that cooks all in, I'm going to probably finish it up on the broiler so we get a little texture on that, a little browning. And that's going to be super, super simple. We're going to do something with the, uh, <laughs> with the asparagus, probably saute it. May even want to bake it. I don't know. We're going to see what's going on. So how's everyone? Steph Hall, Gwen Johnson's. How you doing? Where's Nita? Nita's coming. Um, she's chillaxing. She just said, oh, okay, all right, okay. <laughs> she coming, she coming. She was in. She was in here watching uh, uh, one of these home shows where they where they sell people's houses and stuff. I don't know. Oh, a lot of the people that win the lottery. And the guy helps find a house. Okay, okay, all right. I got so Regina said I'm trying to be a regular order for more season, but I can't do it. I was just on the phone with the girl I told about Tia Brooke. She got her seasoning packet yesterday. She loved them. She also going to be your regular. We thank you again. Look, let, let us know if you need any help. You know what we're going to also do? Anita's got an announcement for you guys before we even start. Mm -hmm. Babe, what? Oh, come, on. <laughs> come on, we got... We, look, look, we got to have rehearsal before we do this. What's the announcement, Anita? The announcement is that we're going to have 10% off. Right. Everything. Right. For the next week. So, next week. because of the coronavirus, I'm so sick of because of the coronavirus, we actually are going to also have the 16 pack 
at the lowest price we ever had it that we said we probably weren't going to do again. But because everything changes, you should never say you're never going to do anything. You can get all 16 of our blends for only $2.98 a bottle. But you, gotta buy 16. but you have to buy 16 packs. And in addition, you're going to get 10% off your five pack. You're going to get 10% off one bottle. You get 10% off everything for the next week. Um, it's our way to give back and it's our way to help us out a little bit because we ain't doing no other events. So we figured, hey, you know what? Uh, help people out. We get more sales. You know, we're, we're kind of uh, transparent. So we tell you guys what's going on. But we appreciate you guys. All you have to do is use the code GREEN. 2020 um we um used that one before us you should know about that one it's capitals all capitals no spaces g r e e n 2020 what's up yo yes never say never so i'm gonna go ahead and start getting uh well my wife it looks like she's doing uh, my mention here so yeah I'm missing. you see how it's hot in here I, I i turned the broiler on early like an idiot and now it's 900 degrees in this little teeny space so i just cut it off i will cut it back on again but pretty simple um i'm gonna actually put you guys on the tripod real quick so i can just cut a little of this off because since we're not cooking all of this salmon i only need about half of it so I only need about half the salmon. We're going to go ahead and take half of that and we're going to put it back in the fridge. So that is all we're going to need. I'm just cutting through here. And this piece is going to go bye-bye. And this is going to be our piece. So we're going to go ahead and I think I'm going to make just two big pieces. But what do you think? Should I do two big piece, pieces or, or, four, or four smaller pieces? Four small. It, it tastes better when it's smaller. Okay, my wife said it tastes better when it's smaller. It sounds like food science to me. It tastes better when it's... Well, we're going to make them from some smaller fillets of this salmon. Uh, we have a late lunch. I'm not that hungry. Not that hungry? Yeah. Well, you might be later on. We'll see. So we got that cut into some nice... Whoop, this one's not all the way through into some nice salmon fillets so those are what we're going to be cooking i'm going to get rid of these this guy right here get it out of here put it in the freezer so we can do something with that later on when did you pick the salmon up before you did that oh well no you're right you're right, babe. You're always right. Uh-huh. So we're going to go ahead and put a date on that if you want it or whatever. So how's everybody doing? How is your Friday now that I found out today is Friday? How is your Friday? I hope everyone's not going uh, uh, stir crazy at home. I hope you're being diligent. Hope you're getting out a little bit. If you can, walk around the block, something, you know. It'll drive you crazy just staying in the house, so I know. Let me see what we got, what we got here. Alec Barney, how you doing, man? From East Chicago, Indiana. Tina Scott is here. Yvonne per Parson, hey, from Hagerstown, Maryland. Good to see you. So again, the, the announcement was that you can get our spice blends, especially the 16 pack, which is pretty popular at the lowest prices we ever had the 16 pack. You can use the code GREEN2020, that's G-R-E-E-N 2020, all capitals, no space, and that'll give you 10% off your entire order, your entire order. So um, take advantage of that. Uh, we gonna fr Malaya, we, I'm gonna freeze that. Um, I'm not gonna cook it in the next couple of days, so I'm gonna freeze it. So. Uh, Eugenia said, I just tuned in. Can you repeat that, please? Was it the code? Because if, if it was, I just said it again. You can go to our website or you can give us a call if you need help. Uh, Paris is stressed. Her husband works in a hospital and started coughing today. Be oh, diligent. Wow. Be diligent, definitely. Yeah, but you yeah. also be aware that it is regular flu season, too. So there's another strain. There's a regular strain of flu to go around. Oh, it's also a lot know. of, since it's been warmer, I don't know how it is where you live, there's a lot of pollen going around. There's a lot of pollen out, so don't be, wait, 
check all that you have all the symptoms and if you do a lot of areas have drive-in testing stations now so I know our, our state does uh, I've seen a couple other states do so kind of look that up be, be diligent don't go crazy what's up Tony call me good to see you again Tony made our, uh, our theme song and we actually played that today um, let's see this message is from Sister Bridget Malone. Let me see what Sister Bridget Malone got to say. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. All right. That's a long message to Yolanda. I'm going to have to read that one later. I'm going to have to read that one a minute later. Well, good to see you all. Um, so we're going to do a really, 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 really super simple. So what I'm going to do here um, is get my bowl here. And we're going to go ahead and make the um, garlic, honey, lemon, sauce that we're going to cook this in. I'm going to get a little of this lemon juiced. Probably about half because I'm thinking I'm going to need only about two to three tablespoons of juice. So I'm going to get a little of that out. A little lemon juice. And we'll finish it off with some lemon slices. I think that's going to be good. So a little lemon juice there. Um, I just have a little broth here because I think I need some water. And instead of putting water, I figured that was going to help with the flavor. So about a tablespoon or so of water or some broth if you have that. Um, I got some honey here. Did I get this honey out? About two and a half tablespoons of natural organic local honey if you have get that in there and it's gonna be our sauce guys so put that in there all right and then I'm gonna give it a pinch of pink Himalayan sea salt just a little bit a little salt and that's the simple simplicity sauce. Well, that's going to cook and it's going to give us a lot of flavor. It's going to be delicious, delectable. But the first thing we got to do, guys, is get these bad boys set to go. All right? So we have this salmon here. I'm gonna hit it with a little of our cooking greens Creole blend. The shallots diced too. Um, I'm gonna put the shallots kind of big because I'm gonna finish the pan off with a little bit of shallots. I'm thinking. A little on, on both sides. But you want to cut it off, or what do you want me to do? No, you can just slice it into some, you know, slices. That's all. A little of our Creole blend. It's our Cajun style blend that we have. Kind of season that a little bit. I have the skin on. Yep, you can have the skin off if you want. Just FYI, if you do this um, recipe and you don't have a non-stick pan, it's probably going to stick. So try to use a non-stick pan. Or if not, if you don't have a non-stick pan, take the skin off. That's all. Skin is good for you. So there we go. We got a little of that going on. Yeah, you just cut it like long this ways. Way? Yeah, I'm just gonna put a couple of pieces in there just for flavor at the end. Um, once everything, and I'll cut a little piece of lemons in there. We're gonna throw it in the broth broiler, and I think we'll be good to go. So, we got just a little bit. Didn't go crazy on it, guys. What do you say, babe? I'll try some up for the asparagus. All right. So what we're gonna do is get over here to this pan. Let me let you guys get on up here on the refrigerator perch. Uh -huh. Y'all like to be up there. I know it. I know it. I feel it in my spirit. So we're going to get a little olive oil in this pan. And we're going to get it hot. Hot, hot, hot. Tasha, what's going on? Chicago's in the house. What's up, Nefertizi? Good to see you. Uh, Latanya, Bray, Brabham, Brab, Brabham, I guess. Uh, Teresa says she loves salmon and asparagus. 
Yvette Parsons from Hagerstown is here. How y'all doing, man? It's good to see all of you guys, man. What about spraying Pam? She's saying to, to keep it from sticking. I don't know, because we're cooking the honey and everything in the pan, so I don't know if it's going to give you a lot of... It's just going to make that oil bubble up into the sauce, and I think you're going to lose a lot of your non-stick. So use a, get a non-stick pan. Um, you can get them everywhere, and they're not super expensive, these non-stick pans anymore. I think we got this one from Restaurant Depot on sale for about 14 bucks or something like that. And it's a nice, large... Um, saute type pan. So we're getting it, getting it real quick. We're gonna uh, cook the cook the um, the salmon a little bit. Um, just have it cooked down, and we're gonna finish it off in that sauce. We're gonna let that sauce reduce a little bit, and then we're gonna go ahead and pop it in there in that broiler. I don't know why I'm putting it in like that so abrupt, but I might. It's gonna be a little smoother. I'm just gonna slide it in there like that. Okay. And then, we, and then we're going to have a quick, easy, whole food meal once again. So simple, even a boy can do it. Somebody said parchment paper won't stick, but but you know, you can't, you're not going to cook your sauce on parchment paper. You see what I'm saying? Maybe y'all missing it. <laughs> we're cooking the sauce, I guess, in there. We're going to just, we're going we're to watch. We're going to watch. But I hear what you're saying. Parchment paper probably will not stick if I was baking it all, but I'm, I'm unfortunately not doing that. So we're going to get these bad boys in here. What's up, Rachel Clark? How's everyone doing? Again, if you want to purchase our spice blends, you can get them on our website. Of course, you can give us a call, hit us up in the messenger. We will call you back uh, with your phone number. But they are all on sale now. It's called the coronavirus sale. That's what we call in this. No, we're it's not. The corona. It's the coronavirus sale. And everything is 10% off. That's about the cheapest that we've had, our 16-pack. So it should be super, super great. It's a good deal. A lot of people took advantage of it last time, and we figured, hey, you know what? Let's, let's just run a little sale, cut everybody a break, cut us a break. So definitely take, a, take advantage of that. You want to do that. Yes, Ryan, uh, asparagus is good with uh, salmon. Anita's probably going to pop off the ends of that uh, stalk. And then we can actually start cooking that at the same time if you want. Okay. We got some spices. Uh huh. Got those spices toasted on the back side of there. Salmon is getting cooked nice already. I need to put the uh, pan on for the asparagus. Put some oil in there. I'm going to go ahead and hit this with the rest of the garlic.
Yo, this is gonna be good. Oh my gosh. I already know it's gonna be good. I'm already show of it. Thanks, babe. I'm gonna get you guys up here so I can get my hands free for a sec. Aretha Brittle, good to see you again. Gonna get my honey sauce here. My honey and my lemon. to about a medium. They said that's going to be really good and nice. It's so simple. Is it, there any way to taste, to change the taste of the salmon, somebody said? Mm. That's weird. I don't know. What do you want it to taste like? Right. Um, you can always do it with spice blends, of course. Um, we have Tex-Mex. You can give it a little, a little uh, Mexican-style uh, taste. We have a Creole blend. We have lemon pepper. We have a bacon, um, maple bacon that is actually vegan. You can sprinkle some of that on. It gives you a nice little bacon seasoning. I think the only way you really can change it again is still going to be, it's still going to be. Uh, what am I trying to say? It's still going to be um, salmon. Yeah, you can't really do much about that but um no I guess my answer unless you're talking season wise yes then of course season wise you definitely can so our salmon is looking good we're just going to allow it to reduce that sauce down a little bit And it's not going to be too overpowering, not going to be too sweet. Uh, it's got lemon in there. It's got a lot of our Creole blends in there. What do you say, baby? Uh-huh. It's supposed to reduce like that. I'm going to go ahead and put our broiler on. We're going to finish it off with the broiler. It's pretty much almost done already, guys. It's super almost done already. We already have some rice left over. So we're gonna have that over over some rice. I like what's happening there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Getting a little of that sauce over there. And uh, and I might not even need to finish this off in uh might not even need to finish this off in the broiler. I think I like where this is. I was gonna finish it off in the broiler. I'm about to turn my broiler off. That broiler is off now. Off broiler, cancel. And that pretty much is done. It's a nice simple it's light enough we've got a little honey flavor in there it's got a little lemon flavor in there it's got a little bit of our creole blend on there these bad boys are done you heard so that is i thought i turned it off i guess i didn't now it's off and our salmon good and done Finish, finish, finish. Finish, 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 y'all. Now what Nina's doing is she got some of our garlic here. We're putting in there. She put some shallots in there. We have olive oil. Lemon pepper. Lemon pepper um, seasoning blend. Which blend you need there? 
So we use, uh, in there. we use our lemon pepper blend, which has lemon as the first ingredient, black pepper, garlic, pink Himalayan sea salt, onion, red bell pepper for a little sweetness, some cayenne and kelp so you get iodine. Put a little bit in our rice. We'll put a little bit in our rice. So I figured I'd do a little lemon red bell pepper in here just to kind of kind of accent the lemon that we're using in uh, our salmon, our garlic, honey, lemon, salmon. We're going to have it with some rice. It's going to be super light, simple and easy. Even a boy could do it. Sandra said that looks delicious. Thank you. Carla said I just ordered some of your seasoning. I can't wait to try them. Carlos, we appreciate you. We definitely, definitely, definitely do. Now, let me get, hold on. Let me get you guys back over here. Back over here. I want to put a little of this lemon juice on here too. A little bit, maybe a teaspoon or so I'm going to do. Nice and simple restaurant quality food. Did you want the shallots? A couple of holes. Yeah, we can put a little shallots in there. I didn't put them in that. I'm so That's fine. Oh, because I, I was going to finish it up and I was like, I don't really need shallots now. Oh, okay. Because, um, you know. Yeah, I already put some in there. You already put some shallots in here? Mm -hmm. And cool. garlic. So, I, I like them on like a route about there. My wife likes them a little done a little more, but... No, no, no. That's fine. I think we about done on these bad boys here. Let's turn this off. Let me turn this off so you can hear me a little better. We're going to hit it with a little of our no salt onion black pepper. Uh -huh. That guy right there, it's no salt, it's onion, it's black pepper, it's garlic, it's uh, all kinds of good stuff in here. A little bit of that. And now, what we're going to do is we got our, our, our uh, rice uh, warmed up. Warm that up man. Okay, so we're going to finish this bag. In the rice, I put some herbs and a little uh, squeeze of lemon. Uh huh. And some lemon, uh, red bell pepper. Okay, okay, sure. I know this needs to be uh sharpened a little bit. Oh, and I put a little parsley in it. And a little parsley. Put a little color. Okay. I'm just waiting for that to heat up. All right. And then the uh. So we're gonna we're about ready to go ahead and plate this already. I want to see what everything looks like real close up. Super simple, guys. Quick and easy. We got a good cook on that. We got a bunch of flavor on it. You got to worry about, oh, I wonder if it's enough flavor in there. Look, they, we took both of these things to Flavor Town quick and easy. We did not stop. We did not collect $200. That is all. We set to go. Ah, somebody said that salmon looks delicious. So we're going to go ahead and get some plating done on here. We're going to get this rice going. What you need for me, babe? I need this tissue because this thing is not. Okay. You need a, a towel? Okay, so we're gonna do a quick little plating here. Super simple. Here's the rice. Oh, that's nice. You get a little parsley in there. Yeah, and, a little and some spices. Ah, oh, nice, girl. I see you, girl. I see you, boo. I see you, boo. So where's the little um? I'm looking for the little thing so I can put the ramekin thing. Yeah. It's in the refrigerator. I use this one. I use this one. Just so I can get a little, little shapey shape on it on this oh, rice. Oh, I got you. You know what I'm saying, Nina? Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? I don't even know if I want that much rice. I'm just tr trying to be good. If we use a, a, a basmati long grain rice. I should have filled this all the way up, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do what I can with this. Okay. All right. That's that's good enough. All right. Let's get. Some of this asparagus here. Your daughter would like to call it. Mm -hmm. 
nice and fresh. I feel like I want it like that. Oh, it's gonna knock all the rice down, but I don't care. Ain't my rice. Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, it is. Okay, okay. A little asparagus there. You know, I get a nice piece of this. Mmm, mmm. Like that, like that. Mm-hmm. Like that right now. Yeah, yeah. A little of that. You know, get the lemon here. I'm gonna put it right here I'm like that. Cause I ain't that fancy, baby. You know how to twist it? You cut it and you twist it. Oh, girl, you fancy like this? Yeah, I just twist it. Oh, you fancy like this, baby? Like this? Like this? Like this? Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. To, well, I don't know. Shoot, never mind. I don't know. Do I look like I know? I'm making this stuff up as I go, girl. You gonna get a little parsley on there? Okay, okay, okay. And I'm gonna chop a little bit up just so I have some on the plate. A little bit of parsley on the plate. Okay, a little parsley on the plate. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Right, like that, like that. Get a little olive oil on the plate. Like so, like so. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Clementine. Y'all check this out though. Mm, super simple. Super simple. Got a little asparagus. Got a little herb rice. We got a little salmon with garlic and honey. Man, do y'all even see this? Garlic and honey and lemon. What? Look at that. That's screenshot worthy right there. That's screenshot worthy right there. Elizabeth just ordered her five pack. Hopefully, you use the the uh, our our um our ten percent off code. That is good for the next week. Green twenty twenty. G R E E N two O two O. So we use that. And you see everything that we have in here. I use a little of this no salt onion black pepper, which has black pepper, white pepper, chives, onion, garlic, coriander, and red pepper. And then I seasoned the salmon with our pink Himalayan Creole blend. Got chili powder, mustard, black pepper, pink Himalayan sea salt, garlic, thyme, onion, oregano, paprika, cayenne, celery, smoked paprika, cornstarch, sugar, and a little kelp. All good things for you guys. So very, really, really, really simple. And Anita and I are going to have that. We're going to look like we're going to have some leftovers too. So, babe, you want me to make your plate? No, I got it. You go ahead and sit down and taste yours. All right, so we're going to go ahead and taste this. I don't want that much. I told you I had a late lunch. And see what we... You want to taste a little bit, Ma? No, I'm going to fix my own. You're going to fix your own? Okay. Oh, I thought you said you wasn't eating. Okay, things change, y'all. So, boom. Super simple, guys. Really healthy, really hearty, really flavorful, and super quick. Even more important, even more important, it was quick. It was so quick, a boy could do it. Y'all see that? So let's go ahead and get a little flavor. Let's get a little taste on this. All right? Let me go ahead and see my grace real quick. So I ain't no heathen. My mama watching. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to go ahead and check out this flaky, delicious salmon here. Mmm, full of flavor. Garlic, lemon, honey. Just light enough. That, um... That Creole is just light enough in the background, too. That Creole blend, not overpowering. If you know our seasoning blends, they're not really salty. That's good. I need to make a little teeny plate. It's good. The lemon's coming through nice. Mm. The honey is definitely just light and, and, and not overpowering at all. Mm. Super, super good. 
super good. It feels like I'm eating healthy. Maybe I am. I, I don't. It's hard to say. It's hard to say. So you can't have no fish. No. No, mm. we didn't know she couldn't have fish. Super good. So we would have got some else. Just try this okay. asparagus. She said she got lamb. She cooking lamb. Mm. Yeah. Asparagus is still nice and crisp. The lemon is coming through everything. Not again, not overpowering. Nice, light enough. Ah, super delicious. This herb rice that my Salmon. wife made. And she just added some parsley and some of our cooking with greens herb blend in here. And a little lemon pepper. And a little lemon pepper. A little red bell pepper and okay. a little squeeze of lemon. Boom. She's telling me. She's teaching me. That's all I did. Mmm. Freshen Nana says she showed her, her one-year-old daughter that she was trying to eat, eat our food through the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Feed that baby. Feed that baby. Do y'all see this flaky goodness? Do y'all see this flaky goodness? Oh, my God. It's just enough honey, garlic, and lemon glaze on there. Ah. You need a water, Mom? Dirt, give Mom water. I'm to make this so good. Mm. I'm good. I got it. A little teeny bit of spiciness with that Creole you on, like on that. I like but it's it. a yeah. My mom says she likes the, the salmon. Mom, what do you think? It's good. Delicious. It's delicious? Well, dang. Well, dang. Good, babe? It's very good. I like salmon. Nice and light. Super easy. You can do it like yeah, that no fast. Time. Did you see how fast that took us? All we did was, well, we, we didn't have to butcher yeah, a salmon, but we, uh, yeah, my done. mom said, you actually done already. Mm -hmm. Thanks, mom. Just season that very, we didn't, we didn't go crazy with the seasoning on, on, with the Creole blend, but that Creole blend is a nice little additive, actually cuts through a little of the sweet and a little of the lemon um, that's on there. The garlic is good. We cooked it in the garlic. Um, we had the honey. We had the lemon, just a little bit of water. I added a little broth in there, just a little splash of broth. And that was it. That was it. Super simple, super easy to cook. Even a boy could do it, like I always say. Yes. Yeah, my mom says super delicious, so. I can't believe she eats it. <laughs> so, uh, look, Uniquely Brooks said, you've impressed everyone. You don't have to chew like that. Okay. Oh, Calm down. <laughs> Calm down, Brooks. <laughs> we love y'all, man. So we're going to let you guys go again. Remember, the, the, the sale is for one week. It's 10% off everything. You just use the code GREEN2020. No spaces, all capitals. You get 10% off everything. It's a really good time to buy the 16 pack because it's the lowest that the 16 pack has ever been. So you're getting every one of those bottles for about $2.00. 97 or 8 cent a bottle and they run anywhere from three to seven dollars a bottle all right and the prices will be going up a little bit because all of our ingredients have went up so we love you guys man oh maxine said she tried the cucumbers last night and they were good it was so simple it's so simple we look we don't like real complicated stuff we love to cook simple and let it come out complicated so it was simple and it came out really high end. We love, we love recipes like that. So I will type this recipe out tonight. I will put it on our website, just like all of our recipes are, cookingwithgreensfamily.com. You guys can get all of our recipes there, our vegan recipes, our recipes like this, our new recipes, our old recipes, all there. Also, you can get our spice blends. My wife, my mom is making her a plate and she is not playing back there. Mm -hmm. Mom, you she making your plate? I thought you made a plate. Oh, you already made a plate and ate. Yeah. She ain't playing, y'all. So we we love y'all, man. Thank you so much for the hearts. They said we they see you, Mama Green. Uh -huh. The special Lydia, it's on again because you know coronavirus. Yeah, so because of the coronavirus, we decided to we said let's bring about back that uh, ten percent off everything. Everyone kind of liked that. A lot of people jumped on it. It was a good chance to get our, our spice blends at rock bottom prices. They're already cheap enough, but um, you got them even cheaper than that. So um, we appreciate you guys. If you need any help ordering, just hit us up. Got anything, Ma? You got anything to say, Ma? Stay safe. Yes. Stay safe. She always got something to say. Wash your hands. Wash them hands. All right, guys. Sandra Carter said she tried to stir fry. Well, I hope it was good. 
Thank you, guys. We're going to finish this up, and we will see you guys probably tomorrow. All right? So thank you all. Cook on Greens, out. We love you. Peace.